You all should know who this is by now and I'm back again with the fourth syllabus, condominium. And well, here's mine. Okay, that's no condo but it's the floor plan of the HDB flat I'm living in. So, it's still something. In my honest opinion, condo is overrated. I understand that it provides security but its price is too high. Not gonna lie but I've beaten multiple condo security systems before through their side doors to visit my friends as the security guards wouldn't be stationed or patrolling in that area, however, I still respect the job they are doing as it is necessary for them to deter the worst threats such as burglars or thieves. Speaking of which, it's absolutely alright for them to enforce the condo rules but one thing I hate is the tenants who are like this. They think they can have things their way as they're rich and paying the condo bills, moreover, he bragged that he can afford the 1.5 million unit but wouldn't pay the $10 for his friend's parking fee. Some people's minds are just ridiculous. I agree that the main advantage of a condo is that it provides private facilities such as gym or tennis courts for its tenants to use. But, I can argue that the non-condo residents can get to use them elsewhere too, but at a cost of traveling time and separate fees. So, in short, condo is a luxury that is not an average Singaporean's necessity but rather it is just something to brag about. That's all for now and I shall see you next time.